Hello and welcome, welcome, welcome back to the new series. Let's check out some mods. And today we're going to check out another Scooter's Workbench mod. He's uh, got another tractor and I'd like to. It's located under small tractors. It's all the way at the end. It's the International Harvester 4166 four-wheel drive. It's $29,900 in the store. As you can see, 150 horsepower, 379 liter gas tank, goes 18 miles an hour. Now, the nice thing is this is a small tractor, but at 150 horsepower, you're getting a beast of a tractor. So, let's go ahead and see what options this has. Okay, you can get this in... Let me get this spun around and zoomed in. You can get this in three different wheel types. You can get this in the Lizard wheels, the Michelin wheels, or the Trelleberg wheels. Now, the Trelleberg wheels are pretty much what comes on it in real life, which is what I'm going to get. You can get the... It's pretty. This is a pretty basic mod, but it's really well done. I am going to... You can get the regular cab or with ropes, ROPs which is basically just a frame around it. So we're going to get the just the regular. We're going to go ahead, and I think he's going to have a version coming out eventually that's going to have doubles and duels. Um, but for right now, this is the one that we're going to take a look at. All right, let's get out here and take a look at her. It's the 4166 Case IH International Harvester. True to life colors, true to life um, uh, tires, three point hitch. It does not come with a front three point hitch in it. Let's go up on here and take a look from outside. As you can see, it's a pretty basic tractor, but it's really, really nice. Scooter does really good mods. I'm so, so proud to. Uh, know him all right let's jump inside you see the door automatically opens this thing just purrs let's go inside as you can see pretty basic but the gauges do work there's no speedometer hence with this tractor back in the day would not have had one either um, no turn signals and everything else The mirrors are all pretty much lined up where you can use them. Let's double check to make sure. Uh, let's see. Hazards work. Lights work. Front lights are cool. Backup lights work. Sorry, I'm using my SIM dashboard to uh, use this, and it has separate buttons for everything. It's pretty cool. So I'll turn on the front, the back, and the high beams. Okay, as you can see, all the lights work. It has the four lights, the two down by the uh, ground and the two up. Turn that back off. Turn this back on just so everybody can see. Everything works really nice. Turn signal works that way. Turn signal works this way. And I do believe the front one works as well. Oh, this only has the back ones. That's awesome. All right. So let's take this bad boy over to the field and do some field work with it. Let's buy us a cheap plow one that's less than 150 horsepower let's take this one and see how she works oh it has artic articulated steering which you can turn off and on you can make it so it just steers the front first of all i'm going to turn the lights off just because that'd be nuts all right I'll be quiet as I usually do. Now 
Now she goes only 18 miles an hour, but none of the older tractors in real life would have went 90,000 miles an hour anyways. It's been, hang on one second, let me turn my vehicle down again. It's been so long since I've used um, one of these plows. Let me turn the hazards back off again. And we're going to get this bad boy plowing a few passes here. And then we'll wrap it up. It's a pretty basic mod put out by Scooter's Workbench. I will have links to where you can find it over at the GNG Modding Facebook page. And also, Scooter himself will post it on his Facebook page. Um, but as you can see... Let me act like I'm knowing what I'm doing here. There. As you can see, she plows pretty good. I mean, it just, this for a 150 horsepower tractor to get one, let's make sure we can change. Yep, left control and Y. There, now we've just got front wheel steering on. See? Um, but for a 150 horsepower tractor to get one for 30,000, that's an older tractor is pretty amazing. Now what I like is it has the running lights on it. The back and the front stay on. Uh, while you're driving it, which is kind of neat. Like I said, it's been so long since I've used a moldboard plow. Um, it kind of feels good to use one. <laughs> I'm usually using a big square one. But she will plow and she will rip up some ground and you can use her on any pretty much anything you want. And that is, let's get back over here to the pavement. It's a short review today because it's just a basic tractor. It collects nice dirt. As you can see, the day running lights go off when you get out, um, which is, I think, is a, a wonderful feature. It collects some decent dirt on the tires. That's pretty cool. And so this is the Case IH 4166 four-wheel drive tractor, 150 horsepower, 29,000. The download is less than 50 megabytes. As you can see, um, all of Scooter's Workbench's mods are very small files. This is for PC only, unfortunately, um, and I do believe he's, I, I'm not sure. I want to talk to Scott before I open my mouth about that, if he's working on council stuff, uh, because if I'm wrong, I don't want to put my foot in my mouth, um, but he's such a talented modder. He's getting stuff done every day. I'm so far behind on catching up with his mods, and he releases mods every day, so I will be doing reviews on his probably every third day i'll get my let's plays out first and then every third day i'll try to release it so twice twice a week i'll get mods out from scooter and mods out from wm modding and a couple other friends of mine um just so we can keep going with mods because it seems to be you guys like the mods a lot so case ih 4166 
four-wheel drive, turbo, 150 horsepower, 29.9, 29,900 in the shop. You find it under small tractors. You can choose from three different tires. The doors open and close automatically. Day running lights, all the lights, four ways, hazards, everything all works. And once again, everyone, thank you for watching. Uh, look after yourselves, look after your families, and most importantly, I'll catch you all on the flip side.